Well, how are we doing out there? I hope you're all absolutely spot on and thank you very much for watching this video. Now it's morning time and I'm going to do some sausages. I'm going to do them in the air fryer. So let's uh, let's see how this goes. I'm going to take you along with me for the ride. We'll do it, go through it step by step with the air fryer look. So yeah, some sausages. So come and have a look what sausages we've got. So look at these, my good lady's been treating us and we've got some Tesco's finest 12 pork chipolatas, prime cuts of pork, British pork and they're gluten free. So the date, they runs out today so I need to get them eaten so I'm going to put them all in. So let's have a look at these. So basically what I've done, I've just put some foil in the bottom of this pot. This pot sits in the air fryer and I've put a rack on there as well look uh, and I'm going to place the sausages on the rack I hope that's not too that'll be okay on there we'll have a look it's all plate by ear I've never I've never done this before so it's all plate by ear it's all learn as you go along and the more you do it the more you do it the more experience you get and the, the better you get at it and that's all that's all I always find you know I always find if you do it that way then you're gonna you're gonna learn as you go along aren't you you know the old uh, cooker doesn't get used anymore. It, big pizzas and stuff like that, but it's not been on for a while. <laughs> it's on its way out anyway, so we needed another heat source to cook our food and we've got one. So let's get these sausages in here. These little chipolatas. So I'm gonna get them all cooked. My, my nippers will have these, they love the sausages. So let's have a look, let's put them on here, look. So I've changed the rack. I've put this. I've put them lower down because I've got a feeling at the top here they'll 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 burn because the heat source is coming down from the top. So basically, I've put them on this rack, and this is quite good. This rack because you can pick it up, you see, with the handles and pull it out. So that's what I've done. I've done it. I've done it there like that. So I've put them all in. So you put the pot in. Pot sits in there. Look, and then you put the lid down, and there's the um, the heat up there. Look, you've got a fan. And then you've got the, the heat source there, look. So I'll put that down. So I'll switch it on. And then I think we'll just, we'll bake and roast these. So I'll have it on one, 190. And we'll turn it down to 180. Oh, 180, aye. And then we'll turn the, turn the... Oh, hang on a minute. <laughs> I'll do them for fifth, uh, how long shall I do them for? It's about 25 minutes for sausages in the oven, isn't it? So this is half the time, so. We'll go with 13 minutes and we'll, we'll see what they're like. I'll lift it up after 10. There we go, that is that. <laughs> so yeah, so it's uh, Sunday morning and uh, it's just gone nine o'clock. Uh, so I'm having a nice cup of tea as well. Oh, can't be a cup of tea, can you, first thing in the morning? So if you like this um, content, um, video, um, please give the video a thumbs up. Um, and if you've not subscribed, then hit that subscribe button and the bell icon as well. And then you won't miss any of my um, videos. Um, and please leave a comment as well. Um, let me know if you've got... I know a few people have just bought air fryers and they're waiting for them to be delivered. Let me know how you get on with it. And, uh, you know, if you're a seasoned veteran of the old air fryer, let me know how you get on with uh, cooking sausages. Because they're, they're absolutely fantastic, these things. They are brilliant. Pretty much, you don't have to wait five minutes for the, the cooker to warm up. You know, it's bang on straight away, the heat, pretty much, so... I'm very, very impressed with it. Very impressed. When you had it at two weeks, it's a Ninja Foodie Max. A lot of people are asking me that as well. <coughs> Excuse me. Well, I have washed my hands before. If you handle raw meat, you've got to wash your hands, haven't you? I just washed them in between changing the racks. And I will wash them again. Um, so, yeah, so a lot of people saying get on the Ninja, there's some sort of like affiliated program, you can get on with it. Um, I'm not on with that. Um, I'm not endorsed or 
not getting any money off anything. I've just that's just what I bought out of, you know, out, out of um, I bought that. And uh, yeah, I could have bought any um, any sort of air fryer, couldn't I? But um, I bought that one. <laughs> so uh, what I'll do, I'll I'll bring you back when it's in ten minutes. See what it's like. So let me tell you about these sausages. I've just had to go on the website and um, I've just had to do a look, see how much they were because my good lady bought them. They were two pounds and sixty pence. Two pounds and sixty pence for twelve pork chipolata sausages. So I'm expecting these to be tasty. And there is the nutritional information there. Look, if you want to have a look at that. Um, so let's have a look. See what it says about them. So there are the ingredients. There, look. Um, you've got pork, ninety percent. Um, you've got a few um, diphosphates in there, haven't you? Sodium. And one allergy there, look. That must be the allergy there. Allergy allergens in bold. Um, that one there. If you can meta by sulfite, is it meta by sulfite? So that is that. So yeah, so that that's in the the oven. Look, it says twenty five to thirty minutes in the oven there. So. I think I've done mine for 13 minutes, haven't I? So we'll check them, see what they're like. Uh, but it says oven 220 there, fan 200, so I've got mine on 180, so might have to do them a little bit longer or turn it up. We'll have a look, we'll have a look. It's all just uh, a learning curve with these um, ninjas. You've just got to play with them, haven't you? I mean, you... let's see, where did it say where the sausages are from? Down there, what does that say down there? I mean, yeah, it does come with an instruction book, which I have read. And it, I've got a recipe book up there, you know, um, but, you know, I mean, all air fryers are different, aren't they? And you don't know what, I mean, the air fryer that, obviously the, the instructions that come with this air fryer are from, from this air fryer. But, you know, the, everything's different, isn't it? You just can't take them as sod's law, do you know what I mean? The, what it says on there is sod's law because sausages are different sizes put different quantity in you know there's loads of things that come into it you see so i've had loads of people saying oh you, you, you know you've you're not sticking to the um you know it's, it's, it's to the temperatures and all that well i'm just i'm just i'm messing around you know at the end of the day i make sure that as long as the food's cooked <laughs> i've got my result haven't i at the end of the day i'm not gonna eat raw food and I know through experience as well, and a lot of people say get a meat thermometer, that's a good idea, you know, if you've never cooked or used, you know, if you, you've never cooked in your life before, then yeah, get a meat thermometer, I advise you to get a meat thermometer. But like I say, the more cooking you do, the more experience you'll gain and learn, and you'll get to sort of know when things are cooked. Because uh, we've all been there, haven't we? <laughs> right, so I'll, I'll bring you back in a sec. So what I've done as well, I've, I've bought some sauces. I'm going to do a taste test with sauces. So I've got some of this sauce, look. And it's Asda's Smart Price Sauce, look. Asda's Smart Price Brown Sauce. I've got some of that and I've got, I've got HP as well, you know, and on my next, on my next video clip, I'll tell you how much they both are because I can't remember. But I'm going to do a taste test. I thought I'd throw this one in as well while we're doing it because I like brown sauce with sausages and red sauce with bacon. And I'm going to stick some. Um, yeah, that's brown, and this is this is brown as well. <laughs> so it's not been opened. This one. Right, hang on a minute. Now it's been opened. <laughs> Oh, right, let's have a look. There we go. So I can see a, I can see a difference straight away. I can anyway. I'm not getting mixed up. So that's the HP, and that's the um, as to smart price. So let's let's try the smart price first. There we are. That is a smart price sauce. Mm, very tangy. Mm, it's not too bad that, to be honest. <laughs> oh, it's alright. 
quite tangy, I'll be honest. Right, hang on a minute. I need a drink, don't I? So I'm having a drink. So mix it up a bit. Right, let's try the HP. It's more smoother the HP. It's more of a smoother sort of flavour if that makes any sense. But you know <laughs> Yeah the HP's not like wow that's that's far better, you know, it's not it's not like shouting out HP sauce, I'm the best. It's not. The, but I think they're both tasty in their own right, to be honest. I, I I think they're just, yeah, I think they're both tasty in their own, in their own right. The Asda Smart Price is sweeter. It's a sweeter, um, a sweeter one, tasty. But, <laughs> I like them both. I, I can't tell them apart. I can't tell them apart. So on the next video shot, I'll give you the prices. I think they're just as, as good. Oh, it's nearly finished now, look. We're on, that was good timing, wasn't it? So it's just, just finished and then it goes on like a cooling sort of cycle for maybe, I don't know, 10 seconds or so. So we'll have a look inside. I think I did them for 13 minutes, didn't I? There we go, look at them. So that is them, look. So they're not cooked for me. I like them a bit more than that, to be honest. They're not done. So that was that 13 minutes, I'll have to check. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to air crisp these now. So I'm going to... Air crisp, so that's air crisp. Um, I'll do them 190 because it did say 200, didn't it? So I'll do, I'll do. I did have the temp a bit low, so I'm going to do these for four minutes. Four minutes. Let's have a look at that on air crisp. Right. So de definitely the next video shot. I'll let you know how much these these sauces were. So that's one pound forty, and you get two hundred eighty-five grams. That there is four hundred sixty grams, and it's eighty-four pence. Eighty-four pence. So it's 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 a lot cheaper, isn't it? And so value for money is definitely that one, and I would go with taste on that one as well. That might be controversial, but well, taste they're both the same. They're both the same, basically. Uh, they're both the same for me in taste they're both the same and you know stick stick them on some sausages and some bread and butter and if you're not gonna go oh well, this one doesn't taste right this one's um hp sauce <laughs> or this one's uh, asda's smart price sauce you're not gonna do that are you you're not you know there's there is a difference in the taste i mean if you've been having hp sauce all your life and you know the taste you have it every day then you're gonna know a difference but you know, it just shows, doesn't it, in the price. Whoa. There you go. That was that test done. <laughs> so there we go. We've got 50, 52 seconds. So what you can do with this... Oh, now, they're, now they're, they're going now. They're coming out now. Look, they're done. They are done. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to stop it. Look, you can just stop it. There we go. I've done it. So I'm going to get them out. I'm going to get them on here now. So they're on there now, I've got one arm, I'm going to try and get them out with one hand, see if I can do it. Oh, you, need, you need two, don't you? You need two hands, hang on a minute. It's a two-handed job. There's two handles, it's two hands in it, let's be honest. So there they are, look. Done. So what was that, how long did I do them for? 13, 14, about 16 minutes, but I did have it on. 180 dinner i'll turn it up next time and it'll probably be about 13 minutes so half the time from a conventional oven so you a bit of butter been in the fridge that water it's hard as nails so it's good that because it cooled out on that rack as well it's like a cooling device as well isn't it so a bit of butter and you know what i'm gonna go with this one 
<laughs> I'm going with that one. Sorry, but there we go. That is my. We won't be paying one pound forty for that anymore. Let's get a bit of brown sauce in there. I like brown sauce with me with me um with me sausages. It's got to be brown sauce with sausages. Look at that. Oh, oh, oh. So let's get these sausages on. Well, I'm going to cut them up as well. So let's get these sausages on here. Look. I like to chop them in half, me. So we'll do that. Can we see? We can see there, can't we? So stick these sausages in here. Any old way will do, as long as they're on there, as long as they're in. <laughs> there we go, look at that. Right, another controversial one. I like my crust, one crust at the bottom and one at the top and then they're equal then. There we go, look at that. Very controversial that one, but that's just me. And I'm gonna I'm gonna not waste that as well. That's getting that sauce there is getting dipped into as well, look. So let's try one of these sausages. There we go. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, they're lovely, wow. God, they are tasty. They're seasoned well. They're lovely. They're like the crisp outer casing as well when you overdo them. The crunch that it gives you when you bite into them. I like that as well. Mmm. They're juicy. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> they are lovely, wow. So that's that, I'm going to get my kids, get these delivered to my lovely girls in there watching, whatever they're watching, Paw Patrol. So yeah, we've had a taste test and we've had a dem demonstration on the Ninja for the sausages. So that's that, yeah, thanks very much for watching, you got this far, Doff me cap to you, all the best. Take care and I'll catch you on the next one.